The Andrews government is set to announce more level crossings will be removed, creating hundreds of jobs. But protests continue over Skyrail, this time because of the destruction of a centuries-old red gum tree. In a paddock in Pakenham, these tradesmen are creating the heavy building blocks for our railway future. Elevated track or sky rail is being erected through the nine stations between Caulfield and Dandenong. The Premier all nationalistic, about 92% of the product being homegrown. Than 100% Aussie steel. The factory is producing 2,200 concrete blocks, each weighing 26 tonnes at a rate of 17 a day. Next year and election year, the government's expected to announce a policy of removing even more level crossings beyond the 50 already nominated. There's about 180 of these across the metropolitan network and I'll have more to say about our continued focus on this issue uh, in good time. In time, no doubt, for next year's state election. I'm not going to meet to the government on every policy they come up with. I'll be having my own program. But protests continue over Skyrail, this time about a 250-year-old red gum being cut down at Hughesdale Station. And we could have gone hours ago if they come down and shown us the plans, but still they haven't shown us the plans. The original artist's impression of the Hughesdale Station showed the tree surviving Skyrail. Brendan Donoghue, 7 News.